Hey guys, so today we are going to see the shortcut keys for selecting texts and objects in Microsoft OneNote. So let's say you have a lot of text to write or some objects to use, then the shortcut keys provided by Microsoft OneNote can really help you speed up your process. So I have some sample text here and the first shortcut is uh, for selecting all items on this particular page. So if I'm here and I press Ctrl plus A, then this paragraph will get selected. Now, if I press Ctrl plus A again, then the entire text will get selected in this container. And now if I want to further expand my selection, then I have to press Ctrl plus A again. So all the items on this page will get selected. Now the next shortcut is uh, to select all to the end of the line. So let's say my cursor is here and I press Shift plus N, then this single line will get selected. And now if I want to select a whole line, then the shortcut key is Shift plus down arrow. You have to make sure that your cursor is at the beginning of the line. So if I go on pressing shift plus down arrow key, then the text will get selected like this. Now, if you want to, uh, you know, cancel a particular selection, then the shortcut key is escape. So let's say I've selected this and I press escape, then simply the selection will get canceled. Okay, uh, now let's select a paragraph. Now we are going to see the shortcut key for moving a selected paragraph upwards or downwards. So to move a paragraph upwards, we have got Alt plus Shift plus up arrow as the shortcut keys. So if I press these keys, then my paragraph will get shifted upwards. And similarly to shift the paragraph downwards, I have to press Alt, Shift and down arrow like this. Okay, now next, uh, let's see how to increase and decrease the paragraph indent. So uh, let's select this paragraph. And to decrease the paragraph indent, I have to press Alt plus Shift plus right arrow. And like this, I can um, decrease the paragraph indent. Similarly, to increase the paragraph indent, I have to press Alt, Shift and left arrow key. All right. Uh, now, let's see an easy one. If you want to delete a selected text or a selected note or an object, then uh, simply press the delete button then the text will get deleted okay next uh, let's see how to move to the beginning of the current line or to move to the end of the current line so if i place my cursor over here and i press the home button then i'll be shifted to the beginning of this line similarly if i want to move to the end of the line i simply have to press the end button and i'll be moved to the end of the line Okay, now to the right, you can see that I've created three pages. Now, if I want to move to uh, the last visited page or if I want to go to the next visited page. So uh, the shortcut here is Alt plus left arrow key to move to the last visited page and Alt plus right arrow key to move to the next visited page. So I'm here if I press Alt and left arrow key, then I'll be moved to my previously visited page. Similarly, if I press Alt and right arrow, I'll be moved to the next visited page. So that's it for today, guys. Hope you find these shortcuts useful. Don't forget to check out our entire Microsoft OneNote playlist where we have discussed more features and do subscribe to our channel. See you guys in the next video. Thank you.